Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. In my hands is one of Marvel's recent releases. It's Savage Avengers Volume 1, City of Sickles. It collects the first five issues plus part of the, or part of the free comic book day 2019 comic um, that features the Savage Avengers. It's uh, written by Jerry Duggan. Mike Diodato Jr. is the artist. Frank Martin is the colorist. Travis Lanham is the letterer. As you see, it brings together a really interesting group of characters. Punisher, Doc Voodoo, Elektra, Venom, Conan, and Wolverine. Um, you know, when the, the first issue hit, I wasn't too keen on the series. Like, I thought it was decent, but overall it kind of felt a little bit off. And uh, reading this first volume, the complete volume, I, I kind of feel the same way. Uh, it's not a bad comic at all, and, and it definitely has an audience for those who just really want tons of action and and uh, don't want to think too much deeply into what's going on. You're good to go. Uh, but it, it, the comic to me feels a lot like a D&D &D campaign just gone completely off the rails, where that one guy for some reason has a machine gun and everyone else has swords or magic. Um, it, it's, it's an interesting comic. It's an interesting debut. Um, and as I said, it's, it's not bad at all. And kind of the... Um, so it's the hand is teamed up with a wizard from the Hyborian Age, so it's an enemy of Conan, who've come over to the Savage Land, and they're trying to like unleash this kind of Lovecraftian demon, um, and all of these heroes are brought together because they're part of the spell to make uh, the demon appear, uh, and then they kind of have to go and stop the, the demon and go fight him. Um, it's, it's, it's an interesting, um, it's an interesting start. It doesn't quite feel like a gelling team. Uh, there's definitely some decent moments in there and some really interesting moments and, and engaging moments, but it's just something to me feels kind of off in the c connection. Um, part of it, I think it, it feels like a fantasy comic and then the Marvel heroes are thrown into it, um, as opposed to Conan being thrown into the Marvel universe and having to deal with, like, what the hell is going on. I mean, Conan at one point winds up in a city and doesn't really seem to react at all to being in a city, which seems to me is, is an odd thing. Uh, and you think he would sit there and kind of stare at cars and buildings and say, what the hell is this? But he's totally fine with it. Um, the art is, is cool. Like, I, I like Mike Diodato's work. There's kind of a, uh, I don't know, grittiness to it that, that fits the savage feel to it. You can kind of check out that. I mean, that really sums up, I think, the quality of the work in it. Um, let me go find something a little bit brighter. Go, go a little Conan action on there. Uh, so yeah, I mean, it has cool moments, but overall I think it doesn't quite gel for me. Uh, subsequent volumes might be a little bit better, but this is one really for, I think, the diehards, if you, if you really enjoy these characters, or, or Conan in general. Um, it's just not maybe the direction I would have gone, or, or the... Um, characterizations I would have gone. There, there's some details that feel like they're missing. Um, but as I said, it, it it's weirdly feels like the Marvel Universe thrown into a D&D campaign as opposed to Conan thrown into the Marvel Universe. So there's a little bit of difference in that. Uh, now, if you like this, this is out in comic shops now. It'll be out in, uh, in uh, a bookstore soon. Go support your comic shop, though. I've got a link beneath this video. Put in your zip code or tell if a shop near you. No shop, no problem. We do have affiliate links. Our affiliate links, so we get a small percentage of that. By doing that, you help support our site, though. So thank you. Now, if you're into uh, the Avengers, if you're into any of these characters, if you're into Marvel comics in general, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr. All at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. So until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.